Yo guys, how's it going? Welcome to episode number 7 of the AC Charge. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you're enjoying the series, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. And we're going to go jump straight into the first game, or the only game in this episode, against Lazio. Which, as you'll see from this table here, we are currently joint on points at in second place with them. They've got... I don't even know what their running is, but we've got to contend with them. And if we can beat them, it will give us a little bit of a gap for the um, running of the season. Let's just switch these around. Put my nose in the middle and keep them that way. The rest of the team is looking pretty much fine. Biscalio, Montalivo, Ponaventura, Honda, Griffo, Niang. The difference is Honda's coming out for Halidovic. And that's going to be it. We've got a few players injured. Um, Romanelli suspended. Five yellow cards. Kutcher is still injured. Oligar's picked up an injury. And Insigne still injured. So we're going to get straight into it. And as we've played another game, there's nothing else we've got to go through. We've got Marcetti in goal with Lukic, Bastos, De Vrij, Basta, Biglia, Cataldi, Parola, Philippe Anderson, um, Keita Bold, Bold Adel, and Immobile up top. So let's see if our lads can go, do us a good favour and help us cement that second space at the minute. If things can go well, we might have a good chance of keeping second for the rest of the season. And as I say, we're giving it out to Griffo. And um, where are we going? First chance of the half 10 minutes in, they've got a corner. De Vries is completely unmarked at the back post. How he missed that, I do not know. And how was he able to get that far clear on a corner? The second highlight, we've got Hilevic into Niang. Where's Bellotti going? Or where's Niang going? Bellotti shoots and he's hit the post maybe. But it didn't really come to anything from that. Unfortunately, that should have had a better shot than Naglia into Philippe Anderson, Cataldi. Where's he going? Hoofs it up to Emil Bay, but he's not got straight into Donnarumma. He had no runners beyond him, which is fine for us. Donnarumma's going to play it to Tonelli, into Biscellio, Niang. Where's he going? He's running into the middle, not where we want him to. Hilovic's got it. Tonelli. The passing back into Halilovic. He's got no options really. Bonaventura's got it though. Niang, can he spread a ball through? No. And he gets tackled too easily there and loses it now on the counter now. Philippe Anderson, come on, can we win this back? Not chasing him down. He's got three to aim for. Cataldi just nods it into the back of the net with no one even. Um, getting anywhere near him and why our defenders left Philippe Anderson just to run down that line Bonaventura didn't even try and cut back with him not Bonaventura or Griffo and Cataldi with a clean header not all we need he needs to come back into this now oh Montalivo's won it gives it to Bellotti where's he going and and Lips Bonaventura, Niang, where's he going now? He's going to keep running and goes for this long range shot which doesn't get anywhere. Let's change this up, go to mix passing, sort of, I'm not fussed about the possession, I just want to be attacking more, so let's have a good old yell at him. Show you something else in the second half lads, because that was disappointing as hell. Keita. And stopped him, Chad Cataldi, Chadley, I'm thinking a completely different team. Bellotti goes forward back to go. Yeah. As you can see, they've just changed their formation to sit really deep and defensive. They have the bank of three at the back, then four sitting in front of them. With then the, just the three prongs up top. And Anderson's got another ball in, and he's hit the bar. Why did Bonaventure just hoof that? He should have... Taken it under his control and just turned and passed it away. Yes, I know 
players again. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Go back. Yes, because they've got every player in the middle. Lidovic, Bonaventura, on gender, Bellotti, Bonaventura, where are we going? On gender, Bonaventura hits it. Lidovic, oh, and that was the chance. He was clear in the middle of the box. All he had to do was hit the target. And Antonelli's dashes on, he can stay on. Lidovic, Montalivo, it's tackled, but we don't get anything. Lidovic then can't win it back. And that looks like that's where the final whistle is going to go. And we lose 1-0. Thanks to a lovely move by them for Cotoldi to get a goal. And I'm going to yell at them. Because they've now gone top of the league. And we are two points behind Juventus and three behind them now. So that's not what I want to see. Especially at home where I expect us to do better than that. Um, let's use the club doctor. We don't often use that because it's a new feature. And right. So if you've enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Next episode, I am going to come back after playing the Sampdoria game and do the Juventus and Inter one. Um, one after the other. So I'll see you in the next episode, guys.